on Caesars Outdoor TV. What's going on? What's going on, everybody? I am out here in Jacksonville, Florida, and we are looking at a truck. We're at the, uh, let's see, the Jack's Truck Center. We're looking at some trucks because like I told you before, I am all over the place right now, hunting, vacationing, working, different businesses, different uh, business ventures, things of that nature. So we're out here, we're looking at a, uh, a truck. It's a 2016 or 2015, it's a Freightliner uh, Cascadia, I think it's, like, it's called an Evolution. Uh, great running truck and um, it's, uh, it's an automatic. It has a Detroit motor in it. And uh, I just wanted to show you guys, check it out, see what you guys think. It uh, has right over 700,000 miles on it. We wanted to uh, to come down here and look at it, check it out, and to see uh, if it could be uh, at, a, at a central part of our business. All right, so you guys stay tuned. I'll we'll bring you a video. see that it has soft clothes on the hood that is pretty cool I don't know if you guys heard me it's kind of loud the hood has some type of soft clothes feature like cabinets in a house it's pretty pretty cool so let's go inside brother in here hanging out. <laughs> so there's so many features to this thing, man. We have the trailer brake here and the, the trailer air supply, the parking brake. It's an automatic. So check this out. I know you guys probably like that. That's It's an automatic. No more shift, no more shifting these days. And, uh, yeah. 700, 734,000 miles.
so I had to get out of there. My brother was on the phone. He's also a mechanic. He's getting people's parts together and ordered and stuff like that. So, but what do you guys think about that? 734,000 miles. Can you imagine that much on your car? Can you imagine that much? But uh, this is, I think this will be a perfect truck for the fleet. And uh, we're going to uh, do some test driving. I may be able to uh, to get a video of that going down the road. And uh, But if not, you guys stay tuned. Tell me what you think. Leave me some comments. Like, subscribe. And uh, stay tuned. All Seasons Outdoor TV. What's up? What's up? What's up? All Seasons Outdoor TV. What's going on, everybody? We are uh, down in Jacksonville still. We decided to purchase the... Uh, the semi, the freight liner that we were looking at uh, yesterday, and uh, we're going to uh, pick it up, and we're on the way to the tire shop because we have to get some some tires patched, or just one tire patched because it has a nail in it. But uh, other than that, I'm going to give you guys a. Uh, a quick snippet of the, the truck in motion and uh, and uh, that'll be it so you guys stay tuned and uh, gonna bring some content okay. So we're having an issue with the truck. Like we literally just bought this truck and uh, we're on the side of the road. And uh, I'm, a, I'm a pretty nice guy, but I do not like to be screwed over. So we're gonna get this truck to, we're gonna try to get it to a TA. So what, what's happening is it's just not engaging the transmission is not engaging. So the check engine light comes on, uh, two check engine lights comes on, the regular, the regular engine and the transmission lights. And then with it being a, a, a automatic, you know, even though it's, it's in drive, you know, it's just rolling like it's in neutral. So we were able to safely get it off the side of the road and then we stopped it for a while and then we we re-engaged it and it's working so that's still a problem and we're not even loaded right we're just we're just bobtailing meaning we're just uh it's just a truck we're not pulling a trailer yet no trailer no no load we it's just a truck so that can't happen so we're going to try to make it to a ta 
which is like a truck service center. Well, let me put on my seatbelt. So yeah, we're gonna try to get to a truck center and um, and get this thing diagnosed and call the owners and uh, let him know the situation. All right, y'all stay tuned. All seasons outdoor team. So we finally got the truck straightened out. It was a sensor that we had to get repaired at the Freightliner dealership, which was an invoice for about thousand dollars. So, you know, it was under warranty. So, you know, that was taken care of, but it is ready to go and ready to find a load. We're gonna be doing some power only work and, um, and things of, of that nature. But hey, stay tuned. All Seasons Outdoor TV, I'm gonna bring you some content, some content, and uh, I'll check in with you guys later. Hey.